So can you believe it is already time for my January favorites video? Where has the winter gone? But trust me, I am not complaining one single bit. But in today's video, I'm going to share with you everything that I purchased for myself during the month of January. Now, normally when I do these monthly favorite videos, I tell you I have a crazy list of things that I purchased. Well, this month, it is so true. I'm looking around because of all of the items sitting around me. I have everything from things that I purchased for my upcoming beach vacation, the most amazing gadget that I found to fix the most annoying problem that I've had in my house for the past 20 something years, some beauty products, some entertainment items, something of my husband's. I think there is something for everybody. So let's just get right into it. So first on my list is this jigsaw puzzle. So in the winter time, my husband and I love to sit down on the weekend and do a jigsaw puzzle. This is like a Friday night or a Saturday night type thing. And I found these puzzles that are food truck related. So we bought the ice cream food truck, you know, cause we used to own an ice cream shop, but there are taco food trucks, hot dog food trucks, cookies. There's a food truck festival. These are 500 piece puzzles and it was so much fun. It did take us two nights to do this one. Normally our speed is 300 pieces, but we stepped it up with this 500 piece puzzle. And the fun thing is when I'm done with my puzzles, I'm sending them to my daughter because she and her fiance are loving puzzles too. So we're just passing them back and forth. When you look up this puzzle on Amazon, you will also see that they have so many absolutely adorable dog and cat puzzles puzzles. Those are going to be my next purchases. I bought my daughter a cat puzzle from them for Christmas. I need to get a dog puzzle, but the food truck puzzles were so, so cute. So everything I'm going to share with you in this video is on Amazon. All the links will be in the description box below and I'll pin it in the comments as well. And just to make it super simple, I have everything listed on my Amazon storefront under the category January favorites. And I'll put a link to that in the description box as well. So you can click there and see everything that's in in this video in one place. So I did buy something for Maxi. It's called Musher's Paw Protection. So Maxi is 13 years old. He's a little miniature schnauzer and he's always biting at the pads on his feet. They're dry, they're cracked. This has been an ongoing thing for him for a very long time, but I didn't know that you could do anything about it. Did some research on Amazon, decided to get this Musher's Secret and he actually loves this stuff. I thought he was gonna give me a really hard time when I tried to rub this on his paws. No, he loves it. He sees me get it out, he jumps up on the couch, he rolls over on his back, and I rub this on his pads. So it's a thick, almost hard balm, but it does come off on your finger when you rub it. It has absolutely no smell. It is non-toxic, non-staining. It's totally safe if Maxi licks his paws after I've rubbed this on, but I just actually take a couple fingers like this, get it on my fingers, and then rub it and massage it into Maxi's paw pads. It does rub in really easily and he seems to like the attention and I've been using this daily. And then after about the fourth day of using this, I really started to notice a change in his pads. When I would touch them, there are less cracks. The roughness is gone. This boy had some really rough paws that when we would get in the floor and play and he would swat his paws at me, it would hurt because of the cracks in his paw pads. They're so much better now and I think I owe it all to Musher's secret. Great. So I purchased something on Amazon that fixed a problem that has been driving me bonkers for 20 something years. We had squeaks in the floor in our house, but they were under carpet. I had no way to fix it. So I was just living with the squeaks. One day I just got so irritated at the squeaks that I got on Amazon, started doing a little research and found out that they can totally be fixed. So I bought a kit called Squeak No More and I was so impressed with the way that this little set of things got rid of 99% of the squeaks in my floor that I did an entire YouTube video on it. So if you have squeaks in your floor and it's under carpet, watch that video. I'll link it in the description box as well as pop in a card right here and you'll be able to see exactly how we did it. But it was so simple. So this screw, when you snap off the top, totally disappears into the floor, under the carpet. You never know it is there. You can't see it. You can't feel it. You don't see a hole in your carpet and the squeak is gone. This kit, which was only $25, 
was worth every single penny. So I highly, highly, highly recommend if you have squeaks in your floor and you have carpet, you need the, what's it called? Squeak No More Kit. Then you all know I'm headed on my annual vacation. I'm going to the beach and I have bought several dresses. One of them that I'm wearing right now, they are all adorable. I am so excited to just be in the sunshine and wear my little cute dresses out to dinner and doing all the things. So this very first dress is a navy blue and khaki striped v-neck dress. It is super, super stretchy. It has high slits on both sides and I'm petite. I'm five foot two. I weigh 137 pounds and I'm wearing the size small. It fits me perfectly. It is so thin, super soft, very stretchy, very flattering, and comes in several different colors. So the next outfit I bought for my beach vacation is not a dress. It's actually a one-piece jumper, and I'm obsessed, obsessed with this. It is in my favorite color, fuchsia. It has a very elastic top. It's going to be a tube top, a strapless top. It is blousy enough that it will hang over and be a little bit flowy, and it has wide leg pants with pockets. It has a belt that you can tie in the front. You can tie it on the side. This little jumpsuit is so flattering. As soon as this was delivered from my mail carrier, I ran inside, put this on, called my daughter who's going on vacation with us, and I was jumping up and down, and I said, this is it, this is it, I found my favorite outfit. I cannot wait to get to the beach and put this on. So you have elastic at the top, which is gonna keep it right here. You have elastic at the waist. There are pockets in the pants and wide swingy legs. Again, I am wearing a size small. It fits me to perfection and you do need a strapless bra. Now, if you don't have all of this going on, you, you could probably get away without a bra, but this material is, you know, a little on the thin side so you're going to see all the things. I just popped on a strapless bra underneath it and it was perfect. And then I have an off-the-shoulder black sundress. Oh, I love this style of sundress. This is a very stretchy ruched style material like think old tube top type of material like we used to wear back in the 80s. So it does have that little bit of texture up top. It has a very high waist and then sections at the bottom. It does hit me at the ankle, but it is not a huge skirt. It is a nice, slim, yet flowy skirt, and it is so beautiful. Again, this one came in lots of colors. This dress will stay up on its own because of the one shoulder. It is very stretchy on the armhole and this part that goes across here and under this arm. I am going to wear a strapless bra under this one, but if you don't have all of this happening, you probably could wear this without a bra because it's not see-through and you do have this uh, ruching material to kind of disguise all the things. This dress, super, super cute, such a flattering fit. Then the last piece of clothing I wanna show you is a spaghetti strap sundress, and you're not going to believe it, but there is a cut out in the front, and yes, I'm gonna wear it. This cut is a little bit of a stretch for me, but I wanted it so bad, and I'll tell you, as you can see in the picture, it does not show anything. It, when you have it on, this cutout is not near as drastic as it appears on the model on Amazon. It barely shows anything right here, and it's really hot. It's not showing your belly button. It has little adjustable spaghetti straps, and the back is that stretchy ruching stuff. This is a size small in the color khaki, and it has pockets in the skirt. With this dress, I do not have to wear a strapless bra. The material across the front is thick enough and the way this dress fits, it just holds everything in for me. No bra needed. So since we're already talking about fashion and clothing, I wish you could see the pile of shoes that are in the floor beside me. It is almost comical and how much stuff I bought. But let's just start off with these loafers that I shared with you all during the month of December in all of my Vlogmas videos. You all got such a kick out of me trying to find the correct size of these slip-on loafers. I bought everything from a seven, six and a half, six, five and a half, nothing fit me. Well, what I think happened was the size six and a half that I was sent, I think was in the wrong box. I sent it back ordered another six and a half and voila, perfection. And I have worn the fire out of these slip-on loafers. I wear these with jeans, with some dress pants, 
so fun, very comfortable. I have worn them barefoot and also with some no-show socks. So these are fantastic slip-on loafers, very trendy if you're still in cold weather, which I'm sure you are. I am too. These are super cute. Then on to some summer sandals for my beach trip. So I love a good very soft sole slip-on sandal. I do not like to wear a sandal that has a wooden hard sole to it, especially where we go on vacation in Puerto Vallarta. There are cobblestone streets. We do a lot of walking. You need some good shoes. So I was searching around on Amazon and up popped a pair of shoes and I thought, well, those are, that's really cute. Started looking, who knew that Crocs croc brand made actual sandals i thought they only made the big chunky slip on you know put your foot in them crocs oh no crocs make sandals and i bought two pair this is a champagne colored i think it's called nude or champagne on amazon i'll link the color in the description box this is a little slip-on sandal. It does go between your toe, adjustable strap. How cute is that? It just says Crocs right there on the side. You would never know if I didn't tell you that this was a Croc style sandal. I am absolutely obsessed with these shoes and cannot wait to wear them. These are gonna be perfect at the beach because they can get wet. I can wear them out to dinner. I can wear them with shorts. I can get them in the water, multi-purpose, super cute croc sandals then i did buy another pair of crocs very similar to the slip-on they have a little bit of a formed heel right here again pliable just say crocs right here and straps across the top nothing between the toe and there are just four straps right here so cute again lots of colors in the crocs i'm wearing a size six in both styles and then every year i have to get my favorite slip-on thong nike sandals i have been wearing these for years and years i love them and every year i do repurchase this pair in a solid black because i will wear these two pieces they come in solid black. You can get black with a white sole. I do have them in hot pink and blush colored, but the solid black is my go-to. It's my favorite. I wear these at home on vacation. Pretty much every day I have these on my feet. So I do purchase a new pair every single year. This is actually a sticker. Let's take that off of there. Super comfy. They fit me perfectly. Size six again in the Nikes. And this is called the Bella Ka Thong size six. Oh yes and they have hot pink on the bottom so cute so now that i am beach ready with all of my new dresses and my new sandals oh i do have one more pair of shoes to show you all so you know my daughter's getting married very very soon and i bought the shoes that i'm gonna wear with my wedding dress on amazon these are the shoes little kitten heels i believe these are a two inch heel nude color so super comfortable. I ordered probably five or six different pairs of shoes on Amazon. I went to the mall. I tried on all kinds of things. These were the most comfortable. They fit me so fantastic. The price was incredible. And this is what I'm going to be wearing to my daughter's wedding. Yep, let's move on from shoes and dresses and let's talk about beauty for just a second. So when my daughter was home for the holidays, I had her film her curly hair routine and technique. I shared that as a video. You all loved it. And when I was editing that video, I was just so inspired by the way that she did her hair, the actual technique, and I wanted to try her products. So I bought everything that she uses and I have started using her hair technique. Look how good my hair looks. Her products were fantastic, and so I wanna share with you my favorite too. It's the Bumble and Bumble Light Defining Cream. I got rid of the gel that I was using, and I'm now using this cream. And you would think that a cream isn't gonna give you hold, but it, oh my gosh, certainly does. I'm now only having to wash my hair every three days as opposed to every two days because this cream is keeping my curls just like this day after day. I don't have frizz. I have control of my hair. This is fantastic stuff. And I also bought her shampoo and conditioner. It's from Rahua. It's hydration conditioner and shampoo grown in the rainforest. Hydration complex with passion fruit and mango. It has a 
oh, delicious smell. It is so silky, very hydrating, and I'm really enjoying this too. So if you're interested in my daughter's video about how she styles her curly hair, it will be in the description box. Again, I'll have a card pop up right there. She walks you through step-by-step step how she does everything. And then when I get back from vacation, I'm gonna film a video myself using her favorite hair products and her hair technique and explain to you how I'm now doing my curls. Then during the month of January, I bought something that is a game changer. I bought Cinema Secrets Makeup Brush Cleaner. My makeup brushes just get so dirty and I hate cleaning them because it takes forever to clean them. It takes forever for them to dry. And so I bought some of this quick drying makeup brush cleaner and oh my gosh, this is great stuff. It dries in about 10 minutes literally totally dry. You can use your brushes in under 10 minutes. I shared this in another video, which again, I'll link in the description box, but this is so simple to use. Pour just a little bit of the cleaner into a little cup, dab, dab, dab your makeup brush, and then brush it on a clean towel or washcloth. The makeup comes right out. No effort and then it instantly dries. You don't rinse your brush back out. I bought a four ounce bottle. I only used about that much to clean all of my brushes so I could probably do my brushes three or four times with just this little bottle. Great stuff. Highly recommend. Then, oh, in that same video, I had to talk about my Trish McAvoy Instant Eye Lift game changer eye product for me. I have it on right now. This brightens and lightens my under eye area. It seems to smooth it out. I notice the wrinkles less. I, I notice the depth that, that was appearing under my eye. I notice it less. It's the first thing you put on makeup wise. So it's over your moisturizer, underneath your foundation. It goes on flawlessly. You can put it on with your finger or use a little brush. This was great stuff. It comes in three different shades. I'm wearing shade number one, which is for fair to medium skin, the lightest shade available. And this is part of my everyday makeup routine now. Then my husband bought something for himself on Amazon. It is a pair of shoes from a brand called Bruno Mark. He has some boots that he's wearing this winter from the same brand raves and raves and raves about them and he wanted a slip-on style loafer so of course we went right back to this brand and he bought these loves them they're just he just goes on and on about how lightweight they are and super comfortable he loves that there is a rubberized sole at the bottom you can get these exact same shoes with a dark sole but he was looking for more of a kind of fun wear with jeans type look and this is what he picked out. Great shoes, great price, and Bruno Mark does have all kinds of styles of men's shoes. Then I recently bought something for my living room. We, After we renovated the living room, we had a huge blank wall, and I never could decide what to put on that wall. And one day, I came across these botanical prints on Amazon. They were perfect. They're a really big size. They're framed. The colors went perfectly with my living room. Kind of a dark vintage look with little bits of gold, almost a bronzy color in them. And I adore botanical prints. I'm just drawn to them. And I didn't want artwork in the living room that was really bright colored because my living room is very neutral and these were perfect and they do come as a set of two. Then you all know I love to cook. It is winter. It is soup season and I use the heck out of my Dutch oven and I looked down the other day and there was a crack in the enamel of my Dutch oven. So Randy got on Amazon and bought me a brand new Dutch oven. It completely surprised me with it and it's a crock pot brand seven quart enameled Dutch oven. It is red. It is beautiful. It is stunning and I'm actually using it tonight. I'm having chicken tortilla soup. I've made broccoli cheddar soup in it. I've done a roast. It cleans up so incredibly well and it is so good looking. You could actually leave it out on your stovetop as kind of a decor piece. It comes in several different colors. I love the red. In fact, the two soup recipes that are in my newly released cookbook are made in that Dutch oven. So if you're interested in my cookbook, it's called Full Flavor Low Carb Meals. I'll link it in the description box. It's a full color downloadable cookbook with delicious meals. I promise you will not notice that the carbs are missing. I'll tell you a funny story. My father comes over for dinner every night and I've been cooking these low carb meals for him. He has no idea that the carbs are reduced. And when he leaves my house every night, he thinks it's funny to grade my meal. A, A plus, 
B minus, you know, all these things. And his favorite meals in the cookbook were broccoli cheddar soup, chicken parmesan, and a Caesar salad. So check out my cookbook. I think you would really enjoy it. And the last thing on my January favorites is, don't laugh at me y'all, it is a foldable toilet stool. Yep, I bought this to go on vacation with me. If you all watched my video from earlier this year where I talked about the five things that have to happen every single day for me to have a good day, and number two was I have to poop good. But where we go on vacation, the toilets are always elevated. They're tall toilets, and I cannot do my business on a tall toilet. So every year I say that I wish I had my toilet stool from home on vacation with me. I can't take the one from home. So I bought myself a foldable version of a toilet stool. It weighs two pounds. It will easily go in the bottom of my suitcase and you can bet your booty this is going on vacation with me so that I can poop good and feel good on vacation. I haven't even taken it out of the wrapper because I feel like it's gonna pack so much more nicely if it's all contained in there. So those are my January favorites, everything I bought for myself during the month of January that I think you might enjoy. Have a great day. See you later.